this is being discussed broadly, it has to be discussed in depth. The academic uh, approach to it, you have to go to the academic approach, uh, is in my mind inconclusive. Uh, the best conclusion I have gathered from experts is that the access to the internet uh, may or may not be recognized as a fundamental right, but it certainly has become an essential tool, an essential prerequisite to for humans, for, for people to have access to all other recognized human rights. You can't think of people having a real approach to, to exerting the right to education, or to free speech, or to access to information, or to health, uh, family life, a free de human development without access to the internet uh, in an equal way. We may still have people who are free, who are fed, who are made healthy, uh, but they are not equal to those who are connected to the internet. Declaring the internet or access to the internet a right in a country or in a city or in any jurisdiction or globally uh, requires a lot of considerations. You have to consider whether it's a positive or a negative right, whether you classify it as a, uh, on a par, let's say, on the same generation of rights as the previous ones, or you have it as a fourth generation kind of right. And then uh, that comes together with an analysis that has to be done very carefully, which is who is responsible, who has uh, oversight or responsibility to deliver this right. As when I said oversight, oversight over who denies this right. And if there's not, if the, if that right is going to be like every citizen in this country has a right to have access to the internet, then that right has to be guaranteed by the state. It has to be guaranteed with a budget and with a policy that will say that some people will have internet access for free, and you will end up discussing issues of equality, which will entangle you with other rights. So this uh, light, this is not to be done uh, in a light-headed way. But uh, that also tells you why, we, uh, at the same time as we can't and shouldn't uh, hurry to declare internet access a right, one more point being the details. Uh, if you define it as a universal service or universal access uh, requisite, you may have a better definition and it can evolve before you crystallize it. Uh, but the most important point is to do recognize that people who do not have access to the internet are not equally able to exert their other rights in society.